All right, many people have wondered how to make eggs on their griddle. So here's what we're gonna do. We've been preheating our pan on about a three to four. And then what you're gonna wanna do is you wanna test it, make sure it's warmed up and get the butter going. So if the butter starts to smoke up fast, that means you're cooking too high. So you're gonna wanna get the butter going. You're going to see that it cooks up pretty fast once you get your pan going. So a couple things you're going to want to be aware of. It cooks a lot faster than you would normally think. Get another little piece of butter. Just give it a little bit more um, butter to release and then get your pepper get the butter going a little pro tip here if you have any of our cookware is to actually use a little bit of a lid to get that top cooking a little bit nicer Take the lid off. The number one key with this also is to get a metal spatula so you can get underneath it. Get underneath it very nice. And once you do that, you'll realize there's not much more to it. And then you'll actually realize that it's considered to be non-stick. So it takes a little bit of learning, just like the first time you actually did your flip phone to, to an Android or an iPhone. All right, so here's going to be where we're going to try to get under it nice. There we go. Nice little flip. And don't be afraid to add one more little cut of butter. And then that'll give you a little bit more of the base that you need. If you like a little bit more pepper or salt or however you like it, you are good to go. One more time, get back under, get back under, and then you'll see, once again, whoops, we almost lost it there. Let's get it back. Then you'll see that anybody can do this. The key is using that low to medium heat, getting your pan heated up. So the first egg might come off a little runny, but eggs afterwards, um, you're good to go. There you go. And then what's also really cool is you can take a little water and clean your pan. And then if you have that metal scraper, you just kind of scrape it right off. And then, obviously be careful, but you then could dump that water out. And it's that easy. You can take just a little paper towel and wipe it clean. So if you're using this cookware from Cutco and it's either cooking too fast, you're probably on just a higher temperature. And um, there you go. Eggs done on a griddle.